Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, this is going to be for my cancers, my little cancerians. Okay. All right. So this deck is going to be for the first two weeks of January. And let me shut my ringers off. And this deck is your overall energy for January. So let's see. I just looked down. It was 33. I don't know if that's regarding. Well, I said I don't know what that's regarding. But it's, it's 33. It's, it's 6. It's harmony. Um, 33 could just be important. You might just be seeing it for synchronicity. So... Cancer, month of January. Overall energy. Something with light here. And you got the Six of Raphael. Okay, this is like the Six of Cups. New friends, rekindling of relationships. Whether it's um, a friendship or a situationship. Six speaks of balance. Bottom of the deck, you got the two of pence. Whatever it is you're going to be dealing with, it's, it's, it's going to require work. It's the yin and the yang, the yin and the yang. Okay. So whatever this is, is definitely regarding balance. I mean... Embracing something. There's something here that is important to keep the balance. But like I said, something's a lot of work. But I was going to say, like, what do you consider a lot of work? Um, or if you would even consider this work. Huh. Huh. Alright. So, overall for the month, this is Six of Cups. To me, it's embracing what it is that's coming or coming towards you or something that you're going towards or something that's already here. Cancer, first two weeks of January, please. of acorn which is the ten of wands pressure weight holding yourself or somebody else accountable for something it, this is responsibility it's dedication you just could have a lot on your plate but it's also the ten So yeah, there's some type of responsibility where there's something heavy, but I, I don't feel heavy, I feel, and it's funny because in the beginning, I, I felt something light, something with light. You got the three of shells, oh look at 33, the three of shells and the three of acorns. So this is, it, it's like a contract, it's, it's happiness. Productivity, what you put out, you get back. It's time to have fun. Again, mysterious energy. Someone else just had very mysterious energy. I believe it was Pisces. But it's funny, I looked down, it was 33, and now we got the 33 again. And they came out together.
can't start for two weeks. This could be work and love. This could be work and play. Play hard, work hard, play hard. It's too many. I just looked over and saw a seven. Man, you guys are coming out in groups here. You got temperance, the eight of crystals, and the hermit. So you're definitely contemplating something. You got the eight of pens. It, it could be work. Again, this temperance speaks of balance. Using your gut, your intuition. There's some type of harmony. There's some type of happiness that's that's here or coming. But like this happiness is it's it's exhausting. Uh, to me, it's like I it's, I don't think you're like contemplating anymore. I think something came around or is coming around and now it's time to embrace. Something about something about something. You got six cards on the deck. Jeez, coming out in groups. First two weeks, Cancer, January 2020. It's almost like something needs to be healed. You've got the world. Fulfillment, celebration. So yeah, something definitely ended, but a new door opened. This could be some type of spiritual work or something spiritually being aligned. You got temperance, you got the hermit with the eight of crystals. Whatever it is, is work. Once again, something's a lot of work. I definitely don't think you're having too much fun. <laughs> I mean, you're probably having fun, but like, I don't think you're like patty mode. You're going to be celebrating. You got two cards of celebration. Two cards of working really hard. Two cards of balance. You know, that all talks about partnerships, balance, directions. The world is a 21, which is another three. Whatever you're going towards, you know, once again, like embrace it. Because whatever it is, it will be fulfilling. Tell me about the 10 of 8 coin. 10 of wands. Five of feathers. Yeah, see, there's something heavy, but you're you're awfully resilient. There, there just needs to be a new strategy. Get your armor on, though. I don't, I don't know if that's a concern or not. It, to me, it's like. There was a situation where you could have felt defeated. Somebody else felt defeated. Could there have been a third party? Possibly. I just looked down. It was a 10.
But this card isn't about defeation. This is, you know, strategizing. Oh man, I don't, I, whatever this is, you, this is like busy, busy. So to me, you laid the weight down because I looked down, it was a one. And I, and you know, five is all about change. The one is moving forward. This is a month of strength for you guys. Like, whatever you do, stay determined. This is like beast mode. So I keep looking down. I don't know if you're dealing with a Leo or it's just needing strength. It's the strength card, right? But to me, it's. Beast mode. Can I book a three of cups? It's a lot of spiritual energy, temperance, hermit. Whoa. Shaman just popped out. Yeah, see? It's like as soon as I said it, too, there's some type of new new quest like in another five so there's that one there's some type of i don't even i you know i'm not even going to say you're being guided this is there's some type of spiritual i mean i felt it more than just temperance and the hermit and more than the shaman, it's so like angels and a wisdom, guidance, masters, you know. Um, it's like they're leading you right to your happiness. Uh, this isn't where it's like, oh, you, you need strength. This is some type of spiritual power, but it's, it's your power. It's like it's time for you to use it. That two birds of flight. Well, that's a bird, but that's that's got wings, right? Some about ten and ten. Need a crystal. This is the four of crystals, the four of pence. This, but this is, there's something secure here. I don't. You're definitely moving forward, but I feel like you're you're moving away from something you shouldn't be moving away from, if that makes sense. I don't know if you're stuck. This spirituality is your security. That song keeps coming to me. Earth angel, earth angel, won't you be mine? Like, what temperance is reminds me of, like, angel energy. The hermit's all about your inner wisdom, your guidance, masters. You're good with herbs. You're good with any type of shaman work. This is spiritual work. Whatever this spiritual thing is, is your security. You got to put more dedication into something, which makes sense because they want you to embrace, embrace this. Not like get a grip. It, it's, some of you, it's what they're telling me is like, 
they're telling me to tell you to, to get a grip, but I don't see energy of, of chaos, right? I, I see you are going towards fulfillment. There is whatever this heavy weight is, it's ending. Because that's all this door shutting for a, a new opening. But like, not this part, not the, not the spiritual part of the spiritual aspect of whatever this is. Strategize. Don't give up. Is that song coming? Don't you give up, 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 whatever that is. Tell me about the world. I just looked down. It was fifteen fifty, which is ten eleven. Yeah, you got a new stat here. That's way too many. The world. One door open for another. One door closed for another one to open. Try to um. You just embrace, oh damn, the shadow, self-empowerment, ambition, look at all of this, guys. Bottom of the deck, intuition, page of cups, like there's, I don't feel like you're giving up on anything spiritual. I, I don't know, you might be, you feel defeated, you feel like, I don't know, like you don't want to be here anymore. Self-empowerment, ambition, whatever it is you're about to create, it's going to make you feel good. It might have been something you did in a past life too. Um, The beautiful frog. I believe it's a tree frog. Huh. Something extremely powerful spiritually. Embrace whatever this is versus looking at it as too much weight. Okay, I hope that helps. Interesting, very interesting. Love you guys. Bye.